I was four and a half years old when a building caught fire and my dad pulled me from the fire and saved me. I received burns to over 75% of my body. I have, I had second and third degree burns. On June, I mean July 2nd of 2014, I was with my family for 4th of July week and we were at our family's lake house and I was involved in a boating accident that actually resulted in my leg being amputated above the knee on the right leg. Well, I was born with osteogenesis imperfecta, better known as brittle bone disease, and it's basically what it's called. It means that my bones break extremely easily. Today, it was really, really exciting. I could not contain my excitement for the past week. I got to do a lot. I um, got splashed on by Nicholas. <laughs> it was such a, such a cool experience. I mean, I've followed Winter's story for years and I've been able to come here a couple times and visit, but this was such a more personal one-on-one -on -one experience. A little like 10-year-old in me is screaming like, yeah, we did this! I actually watched the first Dolphin Tail movie and that was kind of the first time I'd ever seen a prosthetic. I've never seen a person walk with a prosthetic or anything like that. I do have a gel sleeve and I, it was interesting because people had told me that, you know, winter had actually changed the world of prosthetics forever. It's kind of like my spirit animal. Yes, I have seen Dolphin Tail 1 and 2. I got to see some characters from the movies, Winter, Hope, Nicholas. It was cool to see the scars that he had, and he's a burn survivor, just like me, because I'm also a burn survivor. It's just cool seeing that a dolphin still swimming, still doing many things that a dolphin like, that it just means to me like I, I can keep on doing things that humans do.